The Herald and News. Sunrise Headlines. Your headlines now. Good morning, Klamath Basin. It's Thursday, January 17th, 2019. I'm Kurt Lidke with The Herald and News. Here are a few stories you can find in today's edition of The Herald and News. These are your Sunrise Headlines. Oregon Representative Greg Walden will hold 16 town halls in January across eastern and southern Oregon, and first up is Klamath County. Walden will welcome the public for an open conversation on Friday at 3.30 p.m. at the Oregon Tech College Union. On Wednesday, Klamath County Commissioners considered purchasing the Klamath Falls City Schools-owned property of Triad High School on Summers Lane in Klamath Falls. Commissioner Donnie Boyd suggested they purchase the building for $1.3 million at $2 per square foot, which could allow reduction of the $4 million county loan for Klamath Union renovations down to $2.7 million. The Ross Ragland Theater is hosting a two-day karaoke sing-off competition on January 24th and 25th. A $5 registration fee enters any amateur singers in for one song each night in front of a three-judge panel, while the audience can vote as well on their favorites. The contest is being limited to 50 participants max. Video games, board games, cosplay, casino games, trivia, and more geeky fun await visitors to the annual TechCon event at Oregon Tech on Saturday and Sunday. 2019 will mark the third year in a row that the public is welcome to campus. Open from 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. both days inside the College Union on the OIT campus, it features tabletop gaming, a massive retro gaming museum, game tournaments, a cosplay contest, vendors, and plenty more nerdy fun. And those are just a few of the stories you can find detailed in today's Herald and News. Follow us across various social media sites and heraldandnews.com. Check back often for latest podcasts, videos, and breaking news. Good morning, Klamath Basin, and enjoy your day. 